Devils fall to the Colorado Avalanche 5-3. And in the process, Travis Zajac also went down injured with a lower body injury. He left the game in the second period. And he really brings a lot. I mean, Nova Stats right here says two goals, two assists. But a really fundamental thing he brings is the defense and, of course, his face-offs. Yeah, and right now, if you're the New Jersey Devils, this is more concerning than maybe the loss because right. if he is seriously injured, this is a guy that is arguably one of the best two-way centers in the league. He takes the majority of defensive face-offs. Your PK is so important to everything, all the systems that you want you want to do. And just such a freak way to get an injury. I think it's uh, Ratnan falls on him. And I talked earlier, I just hope that it's not the same leg where he had his Achilles tendon injury back in 2012 because it's one of those things where you don't want that to come back. But for Travis Sajak not to be able to get up on his own, Erica, I'm telling you, that's not a good sign because that guy is tough as nails and I've seen it throughout his whole career. So, like I said, I hope it's a Will Butcher moment where he just, you yeah. know, <laughs> sleeps it off and wakes up and he's ready for Saturday against uh, the Flyers.